Welcome to episode 20 of the Plenty Space series, round 2. And as you can see right here, we have somebody giving, having themselves a beer. Their bar. Uh, but unfortunately we haven't given them anywhere to sit while they do so. so let's get these guys some chairs, maybe some water, and a tea. Uh, uh, I don't know why I can't put one right here, unless it's because of this connection. Put it right there. Let that built up. And because this runs on veggies, the tomatoes, that seems like it'd be a very strange uh, beer base. Tomatoes. I, I don't know. I, I don't drink much, so I know very little about drinking. <laughs> but it just seems like it'd be strange. Alright, so we have the tomatoes, mushrooms, and wheat. We should probably give ourselves some more. Uh, plants just to help out at uh, the bar beer machine. Alright, so we have the tomato. We should put some lettuce, some onion, and some radish. So we got all of that. We're good there. Do we need another starch? Let's go ahead and get some rice. Alright, so. Hello! What do you want? gonna land today. Thank god all day here. Oh. <gasps> we can get this. I don't think we have this one. I think we only have two and that they're both buildings. This is the lowest commission rate we can get. Oh man. Alright so let's go ahead and do two of those. And coin for the rest. And I guess I could throw in that. That. Yeah. Ah, no, 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 no. Appreciate you coming out here, but that's not, not, not that much. Alright, so we're gonna sell some food, some coin, some medical supplies, some bioplastics, some ore, or some GM tomato DNA. Uh, so let's go back into here and break down our current tomato. Flip. Yes. And we will put that new tomato plant in there. I don't know how that'll be different. God, I hope I haven't gotten that one already. Tex. Alright, so no, we have the two storage containers uh, for power and for water, I believe. So. Now we will have our tomato. We still have onion, the two other bots, and some domes, and the two power sources. Speaking of which, I noticed this guy was going down. Um, that guy's good. So let's check our... Um, this is not where I find that stat. Alright, there we are. So currently we're not going down too badly, but we did have that dip. We also still need to hit the milestone power monger, which is 50 or 500 kilowatts of power, and I think we're only doing like 200, 300 at a time. Three, yeah, 300. Onion pad has been built. Good. All right, so uh, now t the decision I have to make. Are you small and you're a small? And you guys produce 20. And what's the medium do? 30. So the two small are better than the one medium. Okay. That's good to know. Alright. So I do want to give us another uh, windmill, windmill turbine. But, um, I consider taking these two out, but that would produce overall less, It'd take up more space. I, I wanted to put a big one there, but the big one doesn't fit there. There asked me, I tried 20 minutes ago. <laughs> because I did the very unpleasant thing of starting the 
recording, forgetting I started the recording. And so when I actually went to start it, I turned it off. So I record all the before and the after the recording and completely missed the whole episode. <laughs> so, uh, I hate it when I do that. Hopefully, my birthday's coming up soon. Hopefully I can get myself another monitor and so I can just have that running on the side so I can look over and see that I'm failing so very very hard. Okay so we have this guy meaning we should build that uh, console I think they're called. Um, unfortunately having this path here doesn't leave us a whole lot of space. We can fit the console right there though. So let's go ahead and do that. And we still have space for another security console or the radio console if we want either of those. Which I imagine I will at some point want both of those, so we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Have you gotten all of your stuff yet? We still need three veggies. They are right there. Thank you. I wish the carrier bots could carry two of the small things. So like they can carry one of these. I wish they could carry two meals or two semiconductors or you know the half packaged. I wish those would could be stacked on the bots. It'd make them even more useful. Look at that. One bioplastic out here. Don't know what it's doing out here. But there it is. Don't know what I want to put here. I do want to put off a room some bedrooms because um, almost all of these are being used. Let's see because we have the six, the five, and then the five here so yeah we're making we have like exactly enough beds for everybody and I was thinking about getting ourselves a new set of colonists. Um, potentially new engineers because we need an engineer to run this and Last time it wasn't running well. We didn't- they weren't using it enough. So let's go ahead and edit this and put in uh, the GM tomato plant. It's fast production and high maintenance opposed to... What's the difference here? <laughs> high production, high maintenance. High production, high- I don't- I don't know why this one's better than the other one but there it is. Excuse me while I move you. For some reason my mic has been incredibly quiet the last couple of recordings and I don't know what to do about that because I haven't changed anything. Alright. Got that guy. Got this. We're gonna have Cujo's bedroom off there. And then I think we're still having a problem with uh, spares and if I take a look I think it's because of the metal. We aren't producing enough. I mean, look at all of this ore we have built up in this area. So, I think what I will do is put another one of these uh, workshops? What are these called? Processing plant. Go ahead and put a processing plant off of this so maybe we can use this and then we'll have a factory off of that. Um, I kind of want to build something out into this area. It's a really good area, but I really want to use this storage. It's currently it's not used at all, so I figured having that processing plant off of that will help with that. So yeah, we have our telescope console and I believe what this should do is allow us to know um, they can detect- predict uh, disasters like stand sandstorms, blizzards, or solar flares it can also work in coordination with the anti-meteor laser, which we will not need. This structure is remo remotely controlled by the console in the control center. This means for it to function, it has to have someone operating it at any given point. Every telescope you build increases the probability of detecting these natural phenomena. Okay, so it's not a guarantee that they will um, find any of the um, the blizzard as it's coming. There's a chance that it'll be able to predict it and give me a warning ahead of time, but it's not guaranteed. So why is that? That guy is low, that guy's low, but that's it. 
rid of me. Alright. So we were building this guy. Still waiting on this. Oh. Maybe it's because it's going so slow is why it's going so slow. <laughs> so we've got ourselves some beer. And pardon. Alcoholic drink. Radishes and tomatoes. Makes sense when something like the wheat's in there, but I don't, I don't know about tomatoes and radishes. And again, they put a lot of weird stuff in their their drinks sometimes. <laughs> so those two are good. We just need the four plastic or er, metal there. Then I'll heal you. Thirty-five commission rate. <gasps> we just did this though. Why? Why would you bring me another good thing? You suck. And at such a good rate. Uh, one there. Over there. All right, let's do that. Get ourselves some more nay. Yes, yes. Alright, good. And then let's go ahead and turn on colonists. We're hoping for an engineer and maybe a biologist. I'd be happy with either one of those for sure. We definitely won't be getting medics or guards. I don't really want to set that to defaults. I don't like their defaults. Alright. So. <gasps> I think if the colonists come in before this guy leaves, we'll only get, you know, one or two people. We might get a big one, uh, if this guy gets out of the way fast enough. Alright, so this guy is being used. So 40%. That means there's a 40% chance that they will predict when that storm comes up, as long as somebody is working it. So I guess there was a reason to have the big one opposed to the medium. Um, just a little unfortunate. I'd kind of forgotten that part of it. Having the bigger one gives you even more chance. Alright, so we're gonna be getting ourselves one person, I think. And it's a biologist. Wasn't really what I needed. Hmm. Did I just leave it? It says no. No, I'm pretty sure we just got two. Um. I'll have to let, wait for that to update. It doesn't update right away, but... No? I thought we had 32 a minute ago. Did I get a worker and a biologist? I didn't need another worker. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we had six engineers beforehand. We'll let that update and find out. Alright, so we just need ourselves some engineers to get out here and build this up. Um, I guess with that, I will go ahead and build ourselves the processing plant. Um, let's see, I want it connected to the. What the? Oh my god! <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta simmer down for a second. I think somebody just died. Um, it looks like they died over here? But I don't know what they were doing over there. What just happened? Why did he die? <laughs> that sound, by the way, was really creepy. <laughs> Coming out of nowhere. Oh my god, why did he just die? Uh, I don't really... Let's go ahead and turn off um, traders for right now. I've traded quite a bit. Um, God, what was he doing over here? Where were you going? I feel like we have enough entrances and exits that they didn't need to be walking over here for anything. Why he die? I don't... Alright, so... I didn't even see who that was. I wish there was like um, something that kept track of all of the notifications. Uh, Alright, so visitors, zero bots, zero workers. So we did get a worker. 
and we just got another biologist, so we've gotten two new biologists. Still not what I wanted. Engineers. Who died? <laughs> I guess we'll have to wait for it to update, because none of that showed anybody dying. You've gone and injured yourself there, MS. Kind of an unfortunate a couple of initials. Um. Yeah. Really shocked somebody died. I'm, I'm kind of sad I didn't see who it was. I'd be sad if it was one of the. Um, well, there's him. He's good. But if, like, Robert. Nope, he's good. Wow. The two people I remember the name of, I just happened to click on both of them. Well, at least those two are good. I think Buns is still good, too. The only three whose names I kind of know. Alright. Uh, I was doing something before Creepy Man made a noise in my ears. So I was making a processing plant, and I was trying to get it to fit. Like... So, I guess. Will this work still? Yes. Who knew? Dead bot. Is he dead dead? There we go. Well, at least he conveniently packed himself on everything else as he died. Still sad. So we've lost two things so far in this episode. We've lost ourselves a bot. We've lost ourselves a person. I'm so sad. Very confused. Dude, can we see your bot? Was it a worker? Biologist? Engineer? Alright. We still don't know who died. Unless he died right as we got a certain person so it stayed flat um, and it doesn't show a dip. I guess I'll just have to look at it when I'm done recording and see who we've lost. R.I.P. that guy. Alright, so... Hello, you. You're not looking too great. You better go get yourself some work done. At least he's half done. Or like, he's still got half of his health. Why has the other bot not been made yet? <laughs> get on bot making. We just need some here. Ew! Oh. I... Okay. Land today, please. Okay, so we have two engineers, a worker, and a biologist. We got four people. That was quite a few more than I was <laughs> ready to uh, accept into our colony, so we better go make them some beds. Alright, so we'll get them a dorm. Stick that out over here. Right off the bar. And then this guy. Ready. Let's get that going. Uh, let's make the bedroom priority. So that those guys have somewhere to sleep. Because we definitely do not have enough beds now. <laughs> let's see. One more check to see if we can see who we need to be. Morning. It does not say. Alright, so we must have received somebody of the same type right as that guy died. So we will not know this episode. I'm sure I'll have it in the title on who the poor last soul was. Oh, so sad. Alright. So, I guess if you enjoyed this episode, check out the description down below for the upload schedule. <laughs> I'm gonna go feed my cat before she tries to eat me. And until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.